All right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content, and let's get right into it. NBA 2K22. We already on 22, man. Listen, they got the cover athletes out there. I know it's not no big news or anything like that, so let's just cut through the BS, get right into it. Then we're going to be talking about some other stuff, but let's start the video. Let it out! If you make it to C25, that's OG status. I was told you could be anything, just don't be average. Down bad, flat pockets, that shit made me sad. Start hustling non-stop, don't plan on breaking that habit. So more or less, man, this is something that we've already known. A lot of people, we we knew it. We already knew what it was. We knew what it is. We 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 knew all of this, man. Um, a lot of the color cover athlete stuff. We're talking about it. We're acting like it's new, all that good stuff. Like, I don't, bro, I don't know. Like, some of this stuff that gets out here is just way ahead of, of what 2K wants. Or maybe 2K leaks it itself. I don't know. But we got to cover athletes. Now, this is the one that somebody that uh that we didn't know about. Let me show y'all what they had this morning. Like, they had this joint up here this morning. And uh, and uh, NBA 2K, they, they, they had the little bitty silhouette of her. And somebody was like 2K, 2K leaks at Intel was able to, uh, was it leaks or was it NBA 2K Intel? I think it was, uh, it was Intel, right? Intel was able to go and, uh, and find the, the, the where we at, man? Uh, the, anyway, they was able to, to to match it up with the silhouette and said, we already know this is Candace Parker. So boom, we knew this was Candace Parker since like eight o'clock this morning. We knew this two weeks ago like two or three weeks ago whatever it was and then uh and then last but not least uh luca luca dunchy so like i said this is stuff that we all we already knew about the cover athletes and all of that good stuff i don't know if we knew about luca though but this one the um i don't know if we knew about luca but the main one we already knew about it like this this one the one that, that had been making its rounds going around all that good stuff we are we already knew about that so i don't understand why we try to act like it's such a big deal or whatever like that you know what i'm saying like i i do i do it's cool but we were thinking we were gonna get some extra information and all that good stuff out of it like like the to me i'm gonna be honest with y'all the initial one this cover right here like we already so we know that this is real or what have you because this is exactly the same deal right so with that being the case um what we want to what what i wanted to say is oh my bad my bad let me, let me throw it up there we knew that this is the exact same deal because this is what was up here this actually it looks like some cover art or what have you because if you can see if i let me, let me use the other one you see right here i don't yeah y'all can't see my mouse you see this crease right here this tells me that this was real like I don't, I don't think it was something that anybody just like this is something that somebody had this ain't somebody that somebody something that somebody photoshopped or did this or that or any of that stuff this crease tells me that this is like a poster or something like that and this is something that somebody had i could be completely wrong or whatever but i, I just I, it just makes me wonder what it is that they're that they planning to do and, and just like we said man it just says includes my biggest thing with this whole thing is that it says it includes the game um you know for all the for all of the systems so it says it includes the game for for 2k22 for both console generations bonus content and all of that now i was hoping that we would be getting some some extra information like we would actually get the box and the cover art and all that good stuff but we didn't get that this time so this time the only thing we, the only thing we can do is just speculate and it says available september 10th all that good stuff so we know it's going to be an early release but the fact that it says ps4 ps5 uh xbox series x xbox uh you know xbox series x, and xbox one and it's got them all on the same line man i don't i don't know like i said I, i'm thinking that they're just going to make one game and, and it's not gonna be two games again. I think it's just gonna be one game and they're just gonna make it cross generation. And just like I told T Mizzle, they should make the tagline be anybody, anytime, anywhere. Just like the old Florida State days, just like Pat Hill at Fresno State, both of those FSUs, they should make it, that should be the tagline and that's where they should be going with it. Anybody, anytime, anywhere. And just run with it from there because it's just like, cross play is the future of gaming, period. 
we don't have to have a computer. We don't, we don't, we don't want to play with PC people because there's enough cheating going on on the actual system, on the actual systems itself. Everybody using Zen, everybody doing this, everybody doing that. So we don't want to use that anyway. I, I don't care about none of that. We, we know that we can play. We don't have to have a PC in it and just have it just like this. And the fact that they have it like this, so who even knows what they're going to get on PC? They might get something else. But the whole point is, I feel like that's, that's what they should do. It's got to be cross-play. And if it's cross-platform, and a lot of people going to say, you know, because a, a lot of people are saying they bought into the idea. You can't buy into this idea, the ideas that these guys throw out there or the propaganda that they throw out because they, they're going to, the developers are always going to push something that makes them look better or shows them in the best light. So when, when they say, well, we don't want next gen to be held back by current, I mean, current next gen to be held back by current gen, it's like, okay, I understand what you're saying, but at the same time, I don't, because some of us have beast computers. I got, I got a, a PC with a, with a 20, a 2060 Super, a 3950X, and, and 32 gigs of RAM. When they put out a game, I don't sit there, I, I, you know what I'm saying? And we got a lot of people that don't have a computer that's that powerful. When they put out these games on PC, I have never said to myself, hey, I don't want to be held back by somebody with a with a worse version of the PC or whatever like that. We don't even worry about those people. Why? Because those people, they hey look, you just play with, you just have to play with a lower frame rate or you have to play with some lower resolution or something like that. You just don't get to play the same version of the game that I am. And that's how they have, that's, that's just how they need to do it right here. Look, if you're on current gen, you're just going to get a watered down version of the game. And you know, like they said, with MLB The Show, if I'm not mistaken, MLB The Show can play cross gen and cross uh i know it's cross plat but i don't know if it's cross gen somebody let me know down in the comment section but somebody told me that that it's pretty much the same game the only difference is that you know next gen has better content and it's uh you know it just looks better better frame rate all that good stuff like that it looks better better graphics and all that to me i just feel like when you're programming a a game and you have to program it for six pieces of hardware versus a ton of different pieces of hardware it just seems like it would just be easier to me that's all i'm saying i feel like if you're, you're programming this game and you're watering it down for for these older systems but you know exactly what the older system can handle i, I just feel like there's something that, that needs to be done man so the ps5 ps4 pro ps5 and ps4 pro ain't that far apart they, they really aren't Xbox Series X and the last, I mean, the Series X and the X and the last version, they ain't that far apart either, man. So I just feel like if you're, if they can do it and make it work on all the different computers, they can obviously do it for six different pieces of hardware. So you're going to have the PS4, the OG PS4, you're going to have the PS4 Pro, you're going to have the, um, you're going to have the Series uh, X, so OG PS4 Pro, uh, OG PS4, the regular Xbox One VCR, and then you got what, like maybe two versions of the other Xbox. Let's say three versions of the other Xbox. And then you got uh, X and S. So that's that's about eight pieces of hardware. It's less than 10. It's way less than a million. So like I said, man, I'm cool with this. Um, I, I, I didn't even talk about the cover art much. That was just a piece to suck people in. But like I said, it needs to be anybody, anytime, anywhere. That's how they need to market it. And they need to hire me for the marketing team, man. Because I'm telling you, man, I'm, I'm so raw at this stuff. I, I know. It, it is what it is. Anyway, man, let me get up out of here. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And uh, I'm going to holler at y'all next time. Till next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK, the People's Channel. Oh, and shout out to my guy that I saw on my site the other day. He came up to me. He was like, yo, Jay Easy, I'm subscribed to you. I was out there in the field working, and my boy said, he know you had to say what's happening, so I'm saying what's happening back to you. And I'm going to holler at y'all next time, man. Guys, please.